Yo, what up, what up, what up? It's your man, Big Brandon Carter. The question I get asked all the time is, what cameras do I use for YouTube? I have a few so we can get into it right now. First of all, the camera I'm filming with. All right, so for starters, the camera I'm filming this video with is the Sony NXT 5. Awesome camera. What I like about it is this flip screen, which is important for me doing YouTube videos, because a lot of times I'm talking, when you see me making a video and I'm talking into the camera, I'm using this shit, you know what I'm saying? Like a lot of the time. Another thing I love about it is uh, it has Wi-Fi. So like I can take a picture and send it straight to my phone. Like so it's a good camera within itself. I can take this picture and immediately just send it straight to my phone uh, via Wi-Fi and then upload that to Facebook or uh, Instagram or whatever. A lot of people ask, hey, what kind of camera you use on, uh, on Instagram? And um, majority of the time it's this one. I have this Olympus Tough. All right, now this camera is awesome. I, this is my everyday camera, all right? As where the Sony is, is, is where the Sony I bring out on special occasions, this is my everyday camera, my go-to. I keep it in my pocket. It gets uh, great HD video. And actually, the, Im the image is, is more of an action cam, all right? The image stabilization on this is better than my more expensive Sony camera. So like, when I do a lot of the day in the life videos, I'm just using this, I keep it in my pocket. Excellent pocket camera. If you're looking for a pocket camera, I'll suggest this. You can get it from Amazon, uh, on Amazon for about uh, $200. It's really, I mean, stunning images. It doesn't have Wi-Fi, that's the only thing I wish it had. But what it does have, oh, the flip screen. The really cool thing about this is it's like really tough. It's really tough. Like it takes a it takes a beating, and of course, it has the flip screen. So like when I'm doing the vlogs, do a lot of talking into the camera. I need to make sure I'm getting the footage that I want. It's not just because I'm a, a narcissist and I want to take selfies, but it is good for that. It's good for that. But it's more like I just need the flip screen, because um, I I've, in the in the past before I had cameras that had a flip screen. I would do a whole YouTube video and realize that my motherfucking face was cut off or my my eyes were cut out the shot or something. So this alleviates that problem. Another great thing about this is this shit is waterproof, all right? It's a waterproof camera. So I, I've gone uh, snorkeling with this. Uh, I was on a jet ski with this shit, taking ill pictures, taking video. Um, uh, this, is, this is my vacation camera. I always keep it with me. The battery life is not great on this thing. It doesn't have great battery life. But that's not a problem for me, all right? Cause like, <laughs> I, walk around, I walk around with like fucking all of these batteries in my bag when I'm, um, when I'm filming, like if I'm doing a day in the life video or even if I'm just like, I just walk around with a few batteries, man. I'm, I, don't, I don't never run out of power. And I have a few of these chargers. I charge them externally. Like I don't charge it through the cam, I charge it with these, with this wall charger. So I have, I have a few of these. I'll put links to where you get the cameras, the batteries, the chargers, you know, all the shit in the description. So like I just make sure, I mean, you know, I take my YouTube shit seriously. Then we have another camera, it's my action camera. It's a, it's a Sony's uh, answer to the GoPro, or their attempt to answer the GoPro. It does everything the GoPro does. It goes underwater. Has a, I have an underwater case for it, just like the GoPro. If you can look on, you can look, there's a lot of reviews online. This is very comparable to the GoPro Pro. But one reason I chose this as opposed to the GoPro was you can buy an attachment for it. Check this out, check it out what I'm about to do, all right? Put it in this, put it in here, bam. Now it's like a regular camcorder. Ah, see what I'm saying? And of course, the flip screen, which I talked about earlier. That's important. But uh, yeah, man, this is a good action cam, and and it and it turns into a camcorder when you need it. This was a stupid buy for me, just because I don't really need an action cam. I never really needed a GoPro. It was kind of an impulse thing. Um, this is good enough for me. This is this goes in the water with me, and I can just hold it if I'm doing some crazy shit. But um, I'm interested in seeing, taking this on like vacation or something this summer and seeing how crazy I can get with it, you know? I'll put a link to where you can get this attachment to. And then last but not least, what's always on me is a uh, Galaxy S4. I just wanna go off the bat to say, Apple makes better phones than anyone. Like the iPhone is, I think it's just the best phone. It's the sexiest. 
It's uh, well put together. The apps are, almost all the apps are pretty much better. But the thing I, I like about Android phones, and Samsung in particular, they're customizable. All right, now check me out. Break open the hood. I can get to the back. So what I did was I got a 64 gig SD card in here. And I need that, so I do a lot of videos with this. I do a lot of videos with this phone. Like sometimes I don't have the stuff on me or for whatever reason I need to do a video with this phone. And I do that so like I have a big SD card in here for extra room, for extra storage. Uh, you know, if you wanna buy a fucking, Apple will charge you just way more money for that. This is the same price, I just bought a fucking $30 SD card. Plus I can take the battery out, man. Like I'm never out of power. I'm never out of power because I can just when this when this when the battery dies I open up the back and then I can just throw one of these batteries in here man I just keep a bunch of batteries I bought off Amazon they all last good I just keep a bunch of batteries with me if I'm out all day man like I might go through three batteries you know what I'm saying but I just I charge them I charge them externally again I have a bunch of these so I just start charge these bottle on the wall then every day man I just I mean this is way more I'll never need this many in a day but it's because I never want to be out. I need to be able to take video at all times, no matter what. And you know, like my social networks are kind of big, 20,000 Instagram followers and over 500,000 Facebook likes, fucking half a million. I'm trying to always trying to communicate as much as I can with them. And on YouTube, like I, I, I comment from YouTube on here a lot. So I just need the power. Plus like my day-to-day -day work, I run like uh, some online businesses. I don't really want to get into particulars of those businesses, but I'm always like working. So like I, I need, if this, if this ever goes out, man, then I'm out of work and I'll be, and I'll probably be losing money. So I just, I take the proper precautions. Another thing I always have with me is hella SD cards, fam. I don't fuck around. <laughs> Not even a little bit. And I keep them in this old weed bag. A lot of times people ask me, uh, like on my Instagram post, they be like, yo, who held the camera while you did that video? You know, or who, you know what I'm saying? Like, they'll be like, who's filming you right now? And I'm like, uh, nah, man, about myself. Yo, I had this attachment, man, and this goes on my tripod. Bam. Videos, that I've done videos with just this, this tripod attachment in my phone, talking into the, 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 the front facing camera. Right, and you know this doesn't have as many megapixels. Front facing camera on my phone is probably the worst camera out of all of them. It's, it's the worst camera I have. And I've done videos that have got hundreds of thousands of views with, with the front facing camera on this phone. So I say that to say, I don't want you to think that you need just a bunch of stuff. Like I bought, I, I bought all this stuff over the years. It's like over $3,000 worth of equipment. But I started with just the phone, you know? Like I was just doing videos with this and it just it just grew. And I'm about to get another camera. I'm about to get a series. None of these cameras that I showed you are like, they're like hobbyist cameras. I'm about to get a pro level camera. I'm trying to debate on which one I want to get, but uh, I just want to take it to a, the next level. So anyway, man, this is just what I use. If you have any suggestions on the pro camera I should get, let me know. I like Sony stuff, um, but I'm, you know, I'm down to check out camera. Oh. Another thing, the best camera we I have is not mine, but I have access to it, and it's Brian's Canon D7. That's the best camera. That's the best camera in, in the whole arsenal. White Boy Brian's Canon D7. Oh, nice. Oh, that's beautiful. What the fuck? That's dope. <laughs> wow. I wish I now could flex do that. and go, ha 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 That helps. Hope I answered the questions. Uh, sorry if you found this boring. Uh, the links to almost everything in the video will be in the description. All right, peace.